The National Children's Alliance surveyed child advocacy centers across the country. Preliminary reports find 40,000 fewer children were served nationwide between January and June this year versus last. That's a 21 percent drop. And locally, Project Harmony says we saw a similar trend. Once um, schools closed uh, in April and May, um, those tend to be high months for reporting abuse neglect. The numbers dropped uh, significantly here in Nebraska. Experts don't think there was less child abuse, rather fewer reports of it. This has been a horrific process for all of us. Uh, and if you are a family that's lost a job, maybe there's some uh, other, you're lacking resources and, and supports. Um, that affects children. Uh, that affects the children that are living in homes. Schools are the number one reporter of child abuse, he says. With kids out of school for so long in isolation, teachers and doctors had fewer ways of catching it. We're waiting, honestly, for that surge to come uh, once kids are back into a safe place and, and schools and can share what's going on at home. We're already seeing the calls pick up in Nebraska. Klein says this spring calls to CPS averaged in the low 100s a day. Typically, they take 300 calls a day. And we're getting close to that again. If you have family members that you're worried about, uh, make sure that you're doing the reaching out and connecting to those children to make sure that they know there's someone out there that could uh, protect them if, they, if something's happening. In Omaha, Stephanie Nolte, 3 News Now.